Today I will prepare chicken cutlet. Let's start it. I have required chicken keema 100 grams, one egg, whole egg we have required, two cups of breadcrumbs, mint leaves. 5 to 6 pieces will be uh, perfect coriander leaves 1 large clove of garlic half inch ginger lemon i have taken half size cumin powder 1 tablespoon Garam masala half tablespoon Salt according to your taste Green chilli And to fry this we have required white oil uh, 2 cups of white oil First I will grind all these spices along with the coriander leaves, mint leaves and uh, green chilli I am not using red chilies here because red chilies sometimes it is very tough to digest that's why I prefer to use green chilli whenever I cook anything. We will grind it and make a fine paste. the paste with the keema mix it well and make a nice dough we just need to mix all this paste with the keema and uh, keema also you can do at your home you just take some boneless chicken and uh, mix it into your grinder you will get this keema and uh, the breadcrumbs what uh, i am using here that is also i have done at my home only i have grinded five uh, toast biscuit in a mixer and my breadcrumb is also ready so everything whatever i am using it all are homemade my dough is ready For 3 cutlets, I have to divide it into 3 equal portions. 100 grams of keema is sufficient for 3 cutlets. Now take oil on your palm and take one portion on your hand and give it a cylindrical shape. After that put it on a breadcrumbs plate. Put some breadcrumb on this and it will help you to give a nice shape to your cutlet. Make your two hand, one will be dry and another will be your wet hand. Wet hand will help you for egg wash and dry hand will help you to coat it with breadcrumbs. It's time to egg wash. I am doing my egg wash here on the cutlet. On first egg wash. It already have taken a very nice amount of egg with this. Now again coat it with breadcrumbs. Now do the process for twice. Twice will be okay for the uh, cutlet. And I will prepare two more cutlets on same way.
all the cutlets are ready now we have to keep it into fridge so that it will get a very nice texture and it will get bit hot so it will be easy for us to fry Heat the kadhai now and pour 2 cups of oil on that to fry the cutlets. Always keep your oil on medium heat because otherwise it will get a nice color from outside but inside it will not get properly cooked. It is medium heat now. Now I am just uh, giving my cutlet into that to fry and you can see that lots of bread crumbs are floating on the oil so the oil already has changed the color. Not to worry about it is now time to fry. It will take 2 minutes to 3 minutes to fry it properly. Once it will be fried properly, it will take a nice brown color. And it's done now almost uh, I am just preparing the next two uh, cutlets and it is ready to serve and it is very much tasty you can have this as your evening snacks or your starter or you can enjoy this with your evening tea also if you do like my channel and my this recipe do not forget to like share and subscribe my channel thank you